Black Label is not for the media. It's not for strangers. It's not for the rest of the fucking world. This is ours. This is a family that we built because we needed it. We are the only real outlaw bicycle club. I hear people going, yo, yo, that's Black, black Label, Label, Black oh, Label. Right. It's a refusal to participate in the culture of waste. Not everyone else is there with them. Very few people think you even want to challenge them. A very strong, tight-knit group of people who always get each other's backs, who live every day like it's their last. It's not just another commercialized MTV fad. This shit comes from the gutter. Somebody give me a sex hallelujah! Thirteen years ago, the time I was living in a junkyard, we had a welder and other equipment to build with. I got to know Jake, and he had told me he had seen pictures of this crazy bike that was two frames high. I said, well, let's build one. The rest is really history, I guess. <laughs> A little black label blood in me, yeah. Huh? Two weeks, by two weeks, I'll be wearing colors. Everybody, get it down! come and show up and say, I want to be in Black Label and get put in the club. We cook meals together, we eat together, we drink together, we ride together for a long time until everybody's sure what you're about. Then they'll ask you if you want to be in the club. This is not some fucking lifestyle shit, you know? Like, it's not like something we do once a week. Like, it's every fucking day. Are you in the Black Label? Like no. <laughs> Any activist community, they think that the thing to do is to make everyone exactly like you. That's not the case at all. The, the goal is to is to let everyone be themselves and still get along. And so I love to see diversity of opinion. The Happy Fuck Clown Club. It's gonna be a club of about seven people. It's all artists. You're gonna surprise Black Label. We're gonna challenge them. And I'm gonna take them the fuck out. Ah!